things to prove to you that God exists. Believe it or not, I used to be an atheist, but that's a topic for another day. Is there something you... Dear atheist, I only have 60 seconds to prove to you that God exists. Believe it or not, I used to be an atheist, but that's a topic for another day. Anyways, I know you don't believe in God's word because you said it was written by man, but yet you still believe in every history book that you read in school that was also written by man. I know you don't believe in God because you say you can't believe in something that you can't see. Well, how are you able to determine right from wrong? How do you know lying is wrong? How do you know stealing is wrong? How do you know murdering is wrong? It's a thought in your mind that says lying, stealing, murdering is wrong. But who created those thoughts? Who created your mind? God did. God says in Romans chapter 1, verse 19, basically, Basically, he's saying that you can tell he exists through his creation. When you look at a building, you know there's a builder. You, I mean, that's the only way. You look at a building, somebody had to build it. When you look at a painting, somebody had to paint it. So you know there's a painter when you see a painting. You know there's a builder when you see a building. When you look at God's amazing divine creation, he is telling you through his word. You know that God exists and he's real. We always think that he exists. The problem is we try to push that away because if we, if we believe in God, then that means we have to live a certain way. So I hope this helps somebody. How to pray.